Good morning, dear students. How are you? I hope you all are doing well and ready for today's session, isn't it? Dear children, today we are going to solve the concept 4.3 at two digit numbers mentally questions from page number 34 from your workbook part 1. Alright, so let's start. First question, multiple choice question. Number 1, the sum of 2 and 3 is, so 2 plus 3 is how much dear children? 2 plus 3 is 5. Let's match our answer with the given option. Option number A, 2. Option number B, 3. Option number C, 4. Option number D, 5. So the correct answer or the correct option is D, 5. So write down D over here. Okay. Now the next question. The sum of 7 and 1 is... So, 7 plus 1 is how much, children? 7 plus 1 is 8, isn't it? So, let us match our answer with the given options. Option number A, 5. Option number B, 6. Option number C, 8. Option number D, 7. So, the correct answer is C. So, write down C over here. Okay? Now, the next question. Question number 3. The sum of 8 and 3 is... So, 8 plus 3 is how much, children? 8 plus 3 is 11. Isn't it? So, let us match our answer with the given option. Option number A, 11. Option number B, 10. Option number C, 9. Option number D, 12. So, the correct answer is option number A, 11. Okay. So, write down here A. Alright. Now, let's move on to the next question. Question number 4. The sum of 1's digit of 21 and 35 is. You have to find out the sum of one's digit that means you have to add one plus five okay so one plus five is how much one plus five is six okay so let us match our answer with the given options option number a four option number b five option number c six option number d seven so the correct option is c six okay write down c over here now the next one question number five the sum of the tens digit of 23 and 52 is, you have to find out the sum of tens digit. That means you have to add 2 plus 5. Okay. So 2 plus 5 is how much dear children? 2, 5, 2 plus 5 is 7. Isn't it? So let's match our answer with the given option. Option number A, 6. Option number B, 7. Option number C, 5. Option number D, 4. So the correct option is B, 7. So write down B over here. Okay, now the next question. The sum of 22 and 11 is, so 22 plus 11 will be how much, dear children? 22 plus 11 is 33. Okay, so let us match the answer with the given option. Option number A, 33. Option number B, 43. Option number C, 53. Option number D, 11. So the correct answer is option number A, 33. So write down A over here. Okay. Now, the next question. While adding mentally, first we add the digits in the dash place. So, dear children, what will be the answer? The correct answer will be once. Okay, the correct answer is once. While adding mentally, first we add the digits in the once place. Okay, now the next one. Question number 8. The sum of 21 and 11 is... The sum of 21 and 11 is, the correct answer will be 32. 1 plus 1 is 2. 2 plus 1 is 3. 32. Okay. Now the next one. The sum of 31 and 13 is, so 1 plus 3 is 4. 3 plus 1 is 4. So the correct answer is 44. Okay. Now the next one, find the sum of 22 and 44 mentally. Okay, you do not have to write the steps or anything. You just have to calculate mentally, isn't it? So how will you do? 2 plus 4, first we'll add the digits in the ones place. So 2 plus 4 is how much? 6. Then again, next we'll add the digits in the tens place, isn't it? So 2 plus 4 is 6. So, the correct answer is 66. Alright. 
Now let's move on to the next question. Next question number 11. Find the sum of 45 and 42 mentally. Okay. So what do we have to do? We have to add the digits in the ones place first. So 5 plus 2 is how much? 5 plus 2 is 7. Then we will add the digits in the ones place. So 4 plus 4 is 8. So the correct answer is 87. Okay. Now question number 12. Find the sum of 54 and 41 mentally. So, first we will add the digits in the ones place. So, 4 plus 1 is 5. Then, we will add the digits in the tens place. 5 plus 4 is 9. So, the correct answer is 95. Alright. Now, let us solve the next question. Question number 13. Add mentally 11 and 80. Okay. So, let us solve first. Question number A, 11 plus 80. So first what we will do, we will add the digits in the ones place. So 1 plus 0 is 1. Then we will add the digits in the tens place. 8 plus 1 is 9. So the correct answer is 91. Okay, the correct answer is 91. Then question number B, 43 plus 53 is equal to? First, we will add the digits in the ones place. So, 3 plus 3 is 6. 4 plus 5 is 9. Okay. So, the correct answer is 96. Alright. Now, let us move on to the next question. The next question. Question number 21. Add mentally 17, 26 and 37. Okay. So, what you have to do? First step will be you have to add 2 numbers the first two numbers so write down like this sum of 17 and 26 is equal to 17 plus 26 is equal to how much 7 plus 6 is 13 carry 1 okay then we will add the digits in the tens place. So, 1 plus 2 is 3. 3 plus this carry 1 will be 4. So, the answer is 43. Okay. Then, second step will be you have to add the answer obtained in first step plus the third number. Okay. So, sum of 43 and 37 is equal to, let us see how much. First we will add the digits in the ones place. So 7 plus 3 will be how much? 10. Carry 1. Next we will add the digits in the tens place. So 4 plus 3 is 7. 7 plus 1 is 8. Okay. So the correct answer is what dear children? The correct answer is 80. Okay. So at the end you have to write down like this. Therefore, Therefore, sum of 17,26 and 37 is equal to 80. Okay, so the correct answer is 80. Alright, now let us solve one more question. Question number 22A. So again, three numbers are there. So we have to solve in how many steps? In three steps. Okay, three steps we have to do. First step will be we have to add the first two digits. So let us write down sum of 52 and 12 is equal to 52 plus 12 is equal to. First we will add the digits in the ones place. 2 plus 2 is 4. Then 5 plus 1 is 6. Okay, 64. Now, second step is what? Second step is you have to find out the sum of the result obtained in step 1. That is 64 plus you have to add the third number. That is 31. So, 64 plus 31 is equal to, first we will add the digits in the ones place. So, 4 plus 1, 5. Then 6 plus 3, 9. Okay, so the result is 1, 95. So the third step you have to write down the result, isn't it? So therefore, sum of 52, 12 
and thirty one is equal to ninety five. Okay, so this is the correct answer. So, dear children, I hope that you all are clear with today's objective, isn't it? So, with this, finally, I'll end today's session by saying, dear children, enjoy your online classes. Have a great day ahead. Thank you.